Hey beautiful Virgos, I hope you are doing oh so well. A little love bonus here for you guys. My fellow Virgos, if you're new to the channel, I'm also a Virgo. Like my tattoo. Um, I reside in London, UK, and if you'd like to, let me know where you reside in the comment section below. Please remember to stay positive. It's the last day of 2021, okay? So it's important to keep your energy up, positive, and illuminated. Because it will set the catalyst for the rest of 2021. Now, I'm picking up on your person's energy in this reading. I've already shuffled and cut the deck. The bottom. I, I'm really fascinated with the bottom of the deck these days. I don't know why. It's just like my new thing. Okay, so your person. Some of you could be dealing with a Capricorn with a temptation card here. But look, the forbidden fruit. You know, someone is very much maybe battling addictions, okay, or, you know, thinking of you. You could be their temptation, you know, all, all up in them. They're still chained to you emotionally. There's a lot of Virgos, five of cups, you know, your person is sad. A lot of Virgos, your person is still emotionally chained to you. And for some of you, your person is dealing with, they're battling some sort of addictions, um, Scorpio energy here for some of you. You know, they're going through a transformation perhaps. Two of Wands, undecided, sitting in their comfort zone, undecided, needing to make a decision, needing to make a move, but, you know, still stood here. Still stood. Let's... Yeah, like if you see like how, how she is positioned, I'm trying to focus as best I can, but. She's not exactly riding that giraffe, is she? It's almost like the lantern's there. The, what is that? Is that the, the key of life or something? The lantern's there and the, the, way, the way is illuminated. You know, the journey is there, but she's not moving. So I feel like your person is undecided. Um, for some of you, they're hoping that you're going to come and see them. I think I spoke about this before, Virgs. Like, your person is sitting there at the window, kind of obsessed, wondering if you're going to knock their door. Look at the imbalance here. There's an imbalance. They gave the energy to the wrong person. For some of you, your person left you, and they gave the energy to the wrong person. That's what I'm getting here. Four of Swords. Hmm. Sitting there, wondering... That type of energy, oh, nine of pentacles reversed, four of cups reversed. Look, yeah, I mean, hmm. let me keep going because I love the bottom of the deck. So six of swords, you know, there's an imbalance here. The four or the six of pentacles, there's an imbalance here. They gave the energy to the wrong person, you know, or they put their time and their effort into the wrong person. There's an imbalance here. They may be having, struggling with money and stuff like that overspending who knows for a sword you know they need to rest they need to calm down i think a lot of them are thinking about you thinking about everything that's happened the nine of pentacles in reverse like really kind of they're not having a grateful heart right now the nine of pentacles in the upright position she's independent he or she you know they're very grateful they love life so think of all the opposites four of cups you know they don't want to be single and they're like, shit, I missed an opportunity here, in a sense. I missed the opportunity with my love for some of you. You could have been dealing with a water sign, Gemini, we got, we got there. Yeah, page of cups. I feel like there was maybe some sort of communication, but it wasn't. It didn't turn out how they, you, both anticipated, okay? It could have been a text, a phone call. Uh, you know, your person may have tried to reach out to you or trying to reach out to you. They're not wanting to um, do a new chapter. They're not wanting to face you for some of you, okay? I feel like this is you guys. Or maybe they're trying to start a fresh start. They can see that you you are very capable. Some of them, they, they think, wow, Virgo's so cold. There's this talent here. Maybe you or your person... Well, both of you have some sort of underlying talent. Maybe an artist, a writer. Could be anything, you know. Yeah, look, High Priestess, secrets. Your person making the wrong choice, not going with their intuition, you know. That's what I get here. I feel like this is you guys saying, shit, I let my guard down. 
and the une- the expected happened. <laughs> you know, because it's almost like, yeah, look, the unexpected, the expected happened. What's that saying? I don't know, Fergs. Yeah. Disconnect, break up, cold, left out in the cold. You got so much love to give. Wow, the past, the call. Maybe you guys are going to get a call. Someone from the past. You know, they want to get someone from the past as well. It's almost like you, you're expecting it. If you're expecting a call, like deep down, you know, look at our card there in the core. But you don't want burdensome situations. No, 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 no. You don't, you don't want to repeat. Tell me more about this person that's still... <laughs> See, I was just getting really addicted to the bottom of the deck there. Eight of Pentacles came out like that. You know, I feel like your person is undecided. I feel like they've, they're unfocused. Their energy is unfocused. Perhaps, you know, do I want to put in the work with Virgo? Do I want to give up? Do I want to, what do I want to do? I don't know what I, what I want to do. This is someone that's trying to focus. That's someone, this is someone I think for some of you, they are talented or they've got, they've got some sort of skill. Okay. They're a hard worker as well. Perhaps they're having issues with work at the moment or, they're trying to focus on work, but they find it very hard to focus because you're on the back of their mind. You know, they may be working and yeah, they're thinking about you. They may be working. It could be just that simple case scenario, like you're at work doing a nine to five, but you just can't get this person off your mind, i.e. you. Tell me more. They're sad, you know, and they have a temper for some of you. Every time this King of Wands comes out, you know, for some of you, they're trying to keep control. They're trying to stay in control. They're trying to make out like everything's all right. And for the majority of it, they are okay. Yet there's this sadness. There's this negative energy that they hold. There is a light at the end of the tunnel, but they're unable to see it. It's almost like playing the victim for some of you. They play the victim. Me, 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 me. But you are there and they are battling with addictions, but at the same time, they are drawn to you. Capricorn energy here, Scorpio energy here, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Look at this. It just it just jumped out. It just jumped out like shit. They're discontented. They are not satisfied. This is like I missed an opportunity. I missed the love of a life. I was happy, or at least Virgo showed me love. That's what I get here. All right. Some of you, there's Leo energy here as well. Water energy. Earth energy. Like, it's almost like you are my strength. You are my strength, you know. What's that song? That's what I'm hearing. You are my strength. They're very discon- discontent. They won't tell you. For some of you, the majority of you, they won't. And they're trying to move on. They're trying to release you. You know, but at the same time, it's like a battle of the minds, you know. They are hoping. They are hoping, hoping, hoping that you, for some reason, will reach out or come and see them. Page of Wands. This is nice. Emperor Energy. This is nice. Four of Wands. Wow. Wow. This is foundations. This is, this is, your person is trying to be stable. And they knew that, for some of you, they knew that you were the one. You made them excited, you know. You made them feel like a man or a woman, you know. You, it was intense. That's what I get here. Strong characters. Whether your person was a strong character or you're the strong character, Bergs, right? That is what I get here. So tell me more about this person. Is there anything else that we need to know? Chariot. You know, for some of you, you're dealing with twin flame energy. You know, especially with that four of wands there in the chariot. That is uh, definitely twin flame energy. So... Your twin flame is is around you, whether it's the past or the future. There's very close pull here. Well, I feel like they are 
they are around some of you may be dealing with a person that is a different complexion of you or you're just like two completely different people i feel like there's sex like the sex so every time i get the chariot card the four of wands the emperor this is um for some of you like the sex was uh what's the word intense you know it was intense kumasatra like some of you that it was very channeled i think a lot of people forget how powerful um sex is and sacred sex is people don't realize that even down to oral sex and how powerful that is on us humans and what it does to us spiritually and how it chains us to people um I feel like for some of you, Becca, you're not going to want to hear this. Your person was was like, you know, Virgo, Virgo smothers me. For others of you, they liked that. For others of you, your person liked the mothering. It was almost like you were mothering this person. Okay? Some of you may have gifted them. Some of them may feel like, oh, it was hard to please you. Some of them may think that you're selfish. I mean, listen, everyone's entitled to their opinion, yeah? <laughs> like, if you ever got called, did you ever got, did you get called selfish? Look at this, queen of earth and then the king of earth. Um, <laughs> both in freaking reverse. See, well, there's a potential for a power couple here or like two peas in a pod. Yeah, at the same time like there's something not so great here because the queen of pentacles in reverses talks about someone that can be a bit of someone that overindulges someone that can be a bit imbalanced someone that can be a bit self-absorbed the king of pentacles is someone that is a bit obsessive over money seeking status can be a bit greedy and need to balance um the material with the spiritual so there was something imbalanced here, you know, regardless. It's like your person shout, and you could be shouting this out at the screen too, like, like they turned me on so much, the sex was so good, but we just, like, there, there was something else that wasn't quite right, you know? Sam, I mean, it's intense. It's intense. Three of Wands. Like, whoever this person is, they find it very hard to move on with that Three of Wands in reverse. They're stuck. Yeah, Ten of Wands. They, they hold a lot on their shoulders. They've got a lot of responsibilities or a lot of burdensome energy on them. Nine of Wands, again, not wanting to sometimes feeling like shall i just give up but not wanting to a need for change a need to see stuff from a different perspective maybe they're shouting oh i wish you could see me different or why don't you listen to me maybe it's your person that needs to see something from a different perspective folks you know yeah like for some of you, you just, a lot of Virgo is just, you know, your person, you, your person feels misunderstood. They also feel left out in the cold. They thought that there was a new beginning here, but clearly there isn't. Because I feel like a lot of Virgos rejected this one, you know, let this, this one go. All right, my lovelies, that is all I have for you. I will see you in 2022, baby. Okay. Be kind to other, others, but most importantly, be kind to you. And I freaking love you guys. Okay, that's it. Period. Love you. Take care.